just kind of roaming around at the event, taking a look at different things. This is on Friday. Uh, looked at a couple of display areas. Pretty cool stuff. The spectators in, in the camp. Got a fella walking over through there. I'm trying to avoid you all Never seen him saluting him, but I will if I have to. Got a command car sitting over here, which is also a reconnaissance vehicle. A couple of pretty cool Jeeps. Morning, Top. And uh, various things on there. Good field operations Jeep, not an old museum job. Nice looking Jeep all together. 30 caliber Browning on it, quite a few machine guns. Come in here and there's officer's basin, Their hygiene. Big hairy ass event, but it's not the big hairy ass day. Tomorrow is the big hairy ass day. It's probably the biggest single encampment that I know of. Uh, let's see, let's not cut through, let's go around. Let me go over here, out of weapons. Uh, weapons maintenance tent area over here. Let me go and look at it. Here's Greg Holtz, Bordello. Clap Shack. This, this is the tent with all the people in it. They're here for VD treatment. Oh, we got a quartermaster's weapons tent here. A collection of carbines, them one rifles. Kind of wonder where they're all at and why you can't buy one. Probably got them all here. Never mind. We got There's a carbine with a rifle grenade launcher on it. Fairly rare. <laughs> so, looks like somebody's been to the flea market here. Been to the Louisville Gun Show. Got a cart full of guns there. 30 caliber brand. There's another 1917. Good looking old gun. Another 1917. Before you send in comments, those are dummy rounds and that. And we got a couple of grease guns laying there. Hey, looks, looks like a table at the Louisville gun show. That's the way. Shower shows or regular Louisville? Both. They have a lot of grass out right there. Now. We're going to make it last year, but it hit the snowstorm up here. Yeah. We just snowed in. We're probably, I don't know, show us shows, man. You just about have to park in, you just about have to park in Jeffersonville and walk in. Well, we were going to fly in, stay across the road. Cost a little bit more money, but... There's something I'd like to have, a set of Sergeant's Parallel Jaw Plier. Great for fixing magazines and springs. VAR magazines, trying to keep them dripping over the tent ropes. Pretty good collection of magazines, 1911s, maintenance equipment. Outstanding stuff. Free tent pegs, help yourself. 1919, looks like I've been blazing away with that guy a little bit. Like I said, this is the big hairy ass deal. I like that show. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, that's about enough of that. Big doings today in County Ohio. Everybody.